motivation as in to, to, to let me say that yes um i knew that uh, obviously i knew the effect of what the song was going to bring mm. um but one thing i've noticed is that we are living in a country where people have two ears we have normal ears and political ears so <laughs> there are certain things that if you say it when people are forcing me to do songs for the NPP, what they tend to, and it's hard for me to explain myself, so I, I normally try not to, because if I do it, it might end in a, in the wrong way. Because right. every song that I've done, that is term, which I, I still see as political, from masses to inflation, it was always government. I never said NPP, NDC. So mm. in these songs, I think they are still relevant when they are. You know, when the issues going on, you can still go back to play the masses. But mm. what I've noticed is that when in a political world, it's, a, it's, it's like a language. They have languages that they speak, you know. So, if you if you have an opinion at a, at a certain point, the person who feels like it's going for them take it as a, as points, mm. and the opponent will take it as a jab at them, right? Mm. And as much as you can come out and say this is not what I meant, it's never going to make sense to a political ear. Mm. So, when I say government, I buy me the. But the JMO is still going on, so Abai is Abai. Whether right. NPP or NDC is mm. Abai. Mm. So that's how I see it. So I don't, I don't speak in a political way. I speak, I speak talking to government and governance, and it's about leader. So if you're a leader, maybe at that point when I release, it was you. Okay. So I'm not supposed to do a new song for, suppose MPP, to say that I'm doing political music. Right. You know, I did a song that is re relevant to date. If you want to still play, so that line there. They're saying that the government so the song is talking about appreciation so i used to put the blame on god i used to do this i used to do that so i used to um and i, I was still stand by that but sometimes when when there's something good you have to appreciate as well right. so that's exactly what the line is about so if i talked about this and that and there's uh there's a good thing to me that has happened right you know because doing so was like a very big thing which i was keen on um i think it's coming back so we might have to drop doing so back again <laughs> so, but when i when i was writing the song i wasn't i wasn't experiencing you know doom so and and sometimes when you say these things psychologically it makes them want to keep up and they, they don't want to fall off track because you've seen that somebody's appreciating the work that you're doing mm. so um, i think for the longest even the first time i traveled to i don't want to mention some african countries i appreciated my country for the first time you know oh, you're doing to, well exactly i've seen that as much as you know we have a we still have a long way to go honestly not to like you know pamper ourselves but if you compare us to certain countries i think we have done some some good and sometimes it's good to push that side as well so that they can also uh work on that not mm -hmm. always you know bashing them but i know the political years would never understand that and they'll try to use that as you know campaign or whatever but i don't want to get into that i just did the music and that's it and it has no uh one-sided thing that people want to take it you know, you know when, when you mentioned it um and released the song well you received quite a number of bashing yes and some people also appreciated it now the rumor was that you had been it was politically motivated mm. and that well your, your pocket or your account has been uh, decorated yeah. <laughs> so were you approached by the mpp no no no, no, no. were you um how about the president himself because no. i know you have quite a good relationship with him um honestly i've not i've not been in touch with the president for for a minute you know um even even the the past the, the Previous government. The previous government. You know, I don't really keep up with uh, a lot of politicians. I take individuals as, as how they are. You know, if if I find somebody to be genuinely a good person, I just keep up with them. And uh, for so for the president, no, we've never. I think the last time we we met him was when that Freema. No, I think we went to Guba Awards and he was there. Okay. I think that was it. You know, I've never spoken to him to date. So there was no political motivation. No, no, no. no. Mm. But the president went on Twitter to appreciate the song. It's very good. It's very good you're bringing this up. And I want to use this opportunity. Because when um, when the whole... When, when you're on Twitter... Mm. I, I know what you're, what you're about to ask. Because mm. you know, when I responded to that... Um, if I was speaking or people were looking at me... And when I tweeted, mm. I was actually trying to make... Uh, 
fun of the situation, mm-hmm. which sometimes is, it doesn't get, it, it's not received well. Right. That's why I really try to stay away from either even even the social media or even going on on, on the radio to speak because you're not if you're not too careful, it might be taken the wrong way. And that was one perfect situation that what I was saying to me. Uh, because when he retweeted, and now it makes it seem like that's what you're saying. It makes it seem like maybe it, 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 it was exactly, you know. So then I just came in to make it lighter to say, you know, Mr. President, you know, we, that's what I'm saying now. If he gets back to what I'll come and speak about it. So don't don't think because this has dropped, you know, that's that's all that. So I want to use this opportunity to uh, apologize to the president if he did not take that uh, lightly. You know, sometimes people can interpret things differently, but to use this platform to say honestly. It was just uh, mean, making a, a situation a bit lighter, you know. Yes. When I bring you home, you have to call When I saw it, I was like, mm, yeah. okay, that's quite hard. Mm. But anyway, maybe there is something to it. Oh, I know how these politicians work. Like, mm, the boy, like, for see him behind closed doors, and then quite the original also came up on the same song. Yeah. It's like-